welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be giving you a tour of Blair's Family Farmhouse Restaurant. And I recently just set it up, so I'm so excited to show you it and some of the accessories that come with it. I'm not gonna be showing you everything that comes with this set. I was planning to do a video review of the restaurant itself, but that just ended up not working out as well as this video. So I decided instead to show you the restaurant all set up with some of the accessories and some additional accessories as well. So let's get started. First, be sure to like this video, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel, American Girl is Awesome. So here is an overview of Blair Wilson's family restaurant. We are going to start off with the dining area, which is this gorgeous outdoor porch. So first we have this gorgeous table that isn't real wood, it is just plastic, but it looks very realistic. And then there are these green benches that go along with it, again, just plastic. However, I do believe that they look pretty realistic and honestly, I do like the design. Up over here, we have these plastic fairy lights hanging. Obviously, they do not work and are just for decoration, but I really like that you can hang them or you can just choose to remove them if you do not want them there. There is a double-sided flooring. This one is a grass side with flowers and then if you flip it over, there is a hardwood design as well. Then there are these two plastic columns that look so adorable and modern, especially with the white wooden rustic look. I just think it looks really pretty. Over here, I have a table set for two people. First, there are these two menus that say Pleasant View Farm on the front. And then over here, we have appetizers, entrees, and desserts. And I think this is just really detailed, especially because they wrote out a lot of the different food items. For the dining setup, I have these two placemats. They are double-sided. There is this white and purple stripe design, and then there is a purple floral design over there. I really like how you can choose what placemats you wanna use. There's other options as well, which you will see later on. And then over here, we have these copper-looking utensils. They are obviously not real copper, but I just think they are so adorable. And then here is a knife. And then there is a copper looking smaller plate, which could be used for desserts or for an appetizer or for cornbread. And then over here, we have a larger plate for the entree. I really like this design. This is something I haven't seen from American Girl before. There is also a purple one that matches the blue one. And then here I have this pink glass and then there is also a yellow one. It has nothing in it, it's just plastic and I just think it looks pretty realistic. I do like how they use some fun spring themed colors as well. Over here we have some more copper looking items. So here we have this pepper shaker and you can twist the top here. And then we have some salt as well. And then in the back corner we have these flowers in a pot. Above the table, we have this really cute set of glass doors. Obviously, they are not really glass, they are plastic, but they are appearing to look like they are glass and you can just pop them open. You can pop one open or both of them and I just think it's great so you can serve the food to the dolls straight from the kitchen. And then next to the doors, I have this sign here that says Farm Sweet Farm, which I think is so adorable. We are now on the kitchen side of the Blair Wilson Family Farm restaurant. Starting over here, we have this tray that the waitress can use to push the food around and other things. So it is on wheels, so it can move quite easily. On the top, we have some extra utensils and plates. Then we have a pitcher of some pink lemonade. And then there are some more menus. As you can see, there are two shelving units and there are some glasses here and then some more placemats. First, we have this one that is purple with some floral patterns on it. And then the back is green with some more floral patterns. And then here we have this purple and white striped placemat. And then the back has some colorful organic carrots. Although it is once again plastic, one thing I really do like is that the tray here is removable so the doll can bring the food just like a waitress in a real restaurant or she can bring the entire cart with her. 
So the kitchen itself is in two separate pieces. There is this piece over here that has the double oven and a countertop with some storage. And then over here, we have this piece that has some more storage and a farm sink. Starting off with the stove top here, on top of the stove top, we have this gorgeous copper-like pot with a floral design and then there are four burners and then there are four knobs for each burner and then i believe this knob here is for the double oven here is the oven in the first oven we have some cornbread in here there are four slices in this tray and they are all removable and then we have another oven here that has this pull out rack which i think is great over here, we have some basic ingredients and tools that my doll can use so she can cook quickly for her customers. So first we have a pot of sugar, some flour, and then we have a wooden spoon here. Whoops. And then over here, we have this knife that is good for cutting meat or vegetables. And then we have some farm fresh eggs. And if you open that up here, you can see that they are different colors, which I find very interesting. So when the food is ready, the doll can put it on this shelf here. There is some food that looks like it's already ready. We have this vegetable appetizer that looks very good. And then we have some chocolate ice cream dessert with a strawberry on top, which again looks adorable. As you can see here, the doll can simply ring the bell when the food is ready. Over on this side of the kitchen, we have this gorgeous farmhouse sink, which I think is once again so adorable. And then there is this faucet here that is removable for washing dishes. The knob here does turn. Over here, there is more counter space and you can see that there is a cheese grater here and some cheese so my doll can prepare some food. And then back here, I bought this from Target. This is not from the set itself. It is a farm fresh sign. It was a dollar at the $3 and below section. And then over here, I have this sign that says, welcome to our farmhouse. As I mentioned before, there is a lot of storage. So over here, we have three more shelves. And then on the bottom here, I keep this skillet for some more cooking. Here I have some more of the food items. So first we have what looks like a pumpkin that has a removable lid, and then there is an egg cooked inside. And if you look on the menu, it says it is a baked pumpkin with root vegetables. I'm not sure if this matches entirely with the items that come with the set, but maybe they do. I know there are some things on the menu that do not come with the set itself, but I do believe you can buy it in a different set. Next, we have some cranberry avocado bruschetta, which is an appetizer. And then next, we have some grilled salmon with wild rice and dill. And then here I have some pesto pasta with Swiss chard, which then again looks so good. The texture and the design is so detailed and honestly looks so realistic. Then on the bottom here, we have some strawberry lemon cake, which I think is so detailed and so adorable. I love American Girl doll food pieces, so I'm so glad to add all of these to my collection. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel, American Girl is Awesome. See you in the next video. Bye!